Back in May of 2015, at our Johnsonville plant in Watertown, our members went home for the night, and then our plant caught on fire. And from that point, their lives changed. And a plant coordinator here at the Watertown plant for Johnsonville. Most companies would have said, hey, we're gonna lay everybody off, and when we come back, if you want your job, well, you can come back and apply, and then we'll go from there. So Johnsonville made a commitment to keep those people on the payroll while we were rebuilding the plant. Our members here volunteered. They're out showing how not only they cared about Johnsonville, but they cared about their community of Watertown. So there's just stories after stories of the volunteer work we did. So tomorrow, we're gonna surprise our members with a great celebration, saying thank you for the commitment they made to Johnsonville. All right, guys, it's 10 to 10. We have an hour and a half before everybody gets here. We're having an Italian meal from a great Italian chef. Let's check out this peppers. And members tomorrow will be totally surprised. They're thinking tomorrow that they're coming in for some safety training, but they're actually going to a celebration for them. For me, cooking with gloves is like kissing somebody with a face mask. You can, you'd be happy. I'm not judging. I'm just saying I will never, I can't even think about it. What's up, man? How you doing, buddy? You good? Yeah. Here's a surprise for you. We're gonna send you to LA and you're gonna learn how to cook from a famous Italian chef named Fabio Viviani. There you go. I have to cook for 150 people, so I need some help. You had a good trip back from LA? Yeah. Last time we were playing, These, today we're cooking, all right? It's a lot of people to feed. First, we're gonna do Johnsonville Italian sausage and pepper with grits. Then we're gonna do Johnsonville Italian sausage, baked penne with four cheese. Right. And we have a little side. We have some nice green bean there. And we're gonna do that with a little gremolata. We have a phenomenal cheese sauce. You wanna taste this, man? Good stuff? Mm -hmm. Come on, everyone, get on the bus. We got 15 minutes to get there. It's showtime. Today we gotta really pull this off. Yes. They have no idea when they walk through those doors at Turner Hall, that it's all about them and nobody else. Welcome everybody. This is a thank you from my heart because you mean so much. For the past 12 months, you've done great things. Johnsonville wants to thank you. I want to thank you. You guys are my family. And you've shown me that this community is your family. The things that you did when you volunteered, Today is all about honoring you. So I got one huge surprise for you left. Your meal today is made by a famous Italian chef, Fabio Viviani. He's gonna serve the meal today. It's an honor and a privilege to be here, guys, with you, honestly. You guys are good people. I heard amazing story about you and the beautiful family that you guys have at Johnsonville. But I have not cooked today's meal by myself. As a matter of fact, one of you has helped. I want to introduce you guys to my official sous chef for the day. Garrett, my man, you ready? It's definitely a shock. We thought we were just coming here for a meeting, so it was really nice to be surprised. The food that we ate today was amazing. It's just delicious. We love Italian Johnson Beer Sausage. Every chef out there, they cook to feed people. 
Feed people means bring people together. It means create good memories. This is what this is all about. This whole experience was amazing. I loved all the food and then to see the expressions on their face. That, to me, means everything. Family means to me that we're committed to each other, that we're going to take care of each other no matter what. Without the members, we have nothing. The members are what makes Johnsonville better.